hello my lovelies and welcome back to my channel. I have a huge Primark haul today. I've got lots of different bits from loungewear, underwear, um, homeware, clothing. Yeah, there is a lot. So I'm going to insert the footage of a few bits that I did film around the shop. Just a few bits that I saw that were new from the last time I went. So I'll insert that now. Like nothing can break me. How come the 
trees get undressed when it's cold And don't they miss the leaves they left behind? Could it be to make the ground shine like cold Until winter comes Until winter comes Until winter comes It really makes me wonder beast I think because it's quite big and I feel like I want to start off with this because I absolutely love it. It is a huge framed print. Now I'm going to try and get up really close so you can see because the backing is canvas and then all of this is hand stitched. It is beautiful. I don't know if you can see and then it's kind of got this light wood frame around the outside. Personally, I would have preferred black, but that's the only one that they do. And this was 12 pounds. Sorry, but that is a bargain, 12 pounds. It's not just like a, um, a poster print. This is a beautiful canvas and then all the hand stitching. I just absolutely love it. So yeah, I think this is gonna go somewhere in my hallway. So that is the, my first, I'd say, pretty much my favorite purchase of this haul. I absolutely love it. Uh, so let's carry on. I'm just, I've got no particular order. So I've got lots of bits, um, but this is another homeware bit. Um, I saw this the last time I went and stupidly didn't pick it up. And then I've kind of regretted it ever since. And I do think this is very much a Zara sort of dupe. So it's a beautiful linen, I think it's linen, cushion with this fluted edge, as you can see. It's a beautiful colour. What is it actually? Oh, it's just natural it's called and this was nine pounds so this is to go in my window seat just over there in the living room i've already got a darker cushion but i just wanted another one as well to tie in all of the neutrals and the uh, navy so yeah i love it really love that stupidly i should have picked up the first time but hey ho um, I bought another one of these. I bought this, you might have seen this in my last 
all. It's the Green Tea um, Home Fragrance and it's currently reduced £2 at the moment. Now the last time I went they had loads of these and they also had loads today. This was originally £4. I love the packaging and the smell is amazing so i've got one of these and i spritz it normally every morning and before i go to bed at night just so my room smells nice um so yeah i picked up another one of those bargain at two pounds and it obviously is fantastic that the scent is amazing too so this is another find now I was a little bit confused because one is a fitted sheet and one is a flat sheet. Now, I couldn't really understand that the fitted was reduced from 17 down to five, but yet the flat was reduced from 17 down to 10, but they are exactly the same. And I bought the cushion, and not cushion, sorry, I bought the pillowcases of these um, the last time I went and they were also reduced this time. So this is a Super King linen deep fitted sheet the color is absolutely beautiful and this was only five pounds reduced from 17 so i've at the moment i've got white bedding but then i've got these pillowcases behind my white ones so i thought it'd be quite nice to have that as a fitted sheet underneath and then now I'm not normally a flat sheet kind of girl, as in putting one underneath underneath your duvet cover, but I thought, do you know what? To have it underneath and then almost just have a lip coming over the duvet cover, I thought would look really nice. And also for the summer months, I just thought if I'm really, really hot, I can just kind of kick off my duvet and then just have the sheet. So this is exactly the same color and it's also a super king but obviously a flat sheet and this was reduced from 17 down to 10. Now I would have preferred it if this had been five, the same as the other one, but can't have everything. So yeah, I was really impressed with those and they feel so soft as well. I picked up a waffle throw. This was 10 pounds and it's kind of like a creamy so i'd say yeah creamy color and it is actually worded as cream as well but it's this beautiful waffle print and let's see what it's made out of 50 percent recycled plastic and then 50 percent polyester so i am soon going to be doing a little bit of a um decor refresh in our spare room we moved in and we haven't really done that much to it um so i'm trying to gather a few bits so that i can tie them all together and then redo that room so i've actually got a footstool in here that matches our sofa um, but we don't really use it, it's actually hidden down the side. So I'm thinking about putting that up in the spare room just as like a little seat and then draping this over it. That was, sorry, £10, I think I already said that. And then just try and keep with the theme of the home stuff. I bought this string shopping bag which was reduced from 150 down to 50p and yeah i just really like it it's just a little string bag perfect for a few bits of shopping and then i bought these now they are distress cleansing bundle five piece of palo, palo santo or palo santo not really sure which one fragrance beach it shows a picture on the back of just i don't really get it to be honest with you i thought you just yeah i think you do actually i think they're designed to put on a tray in a bathroom and they basically sent the bathroom so if i show you the packaging first and then the back it kind of shows to put on a tray this was two pounds fifty and then inside are basically just little wooden sticks, but they smell 
amazing. Sorry, the light. Let me just try moving you a little bit because I think the light's causing a bit of a shadow. So yeah, they're just wooden sticks. That smells so nice. So yeah, I got two packs of those for my bathroom and I thought the packaging was really, really nice as well. Um, and then I bought a 100% cotton waffle hand towel. It is from the Sustainable Cotton Range, 50 centimetres by 90 centimetres, and I love it. What colour? Oh, it's classed as cream, but that is not cream at all. I would say it's like a beigey colour, but yeah, it's beautiful. And that was five pounds. And it's so soft as well. Yeah, I like that. I'm just gonna see if I've got any more homey sort of bits. I bought a spare pack of replacement reeds. They are the black ones and they were reduced from £1.50 to 50 pence. I found this vent paddle brush for £2.50 and I just thought it was really good for actually blow drying my hair to just kind of pull through while I'm blow drying at the same time. Uh, I have a black one of these, but it's like a shower one. But yeah, this one has got definitely more bristles. So I thought that was a really good find. And I've not seen that in there before, so I don't know if it's new. And then in the same range, See, I've not seen these before, so I'm presuming they are new. I've got a mist spray bottle. This was £3.50. Again, in that aesthetically pleasing kind of like creamish colour, not too in your face. Um, I thought this would come in handy just sometimes I get out of the shower and my hair's dried a little bit and it starts to go frizzy. So I like to wet it down a little bit before putting like serums or stuff in it. So I thought that, that would come in really handy got some skincare bits so i found this was, was also in the same place it's called a flyaway brush um it says it's argan oil infused bristles two pounds and i just thought like sometimes when i put my hair up i get all these little flyaways i thought it'd be brilliant to spray with hairspray and then just brush up to get rid of all those flyaways i got some cosmetic pads Always buy them from Primark, 90p, they are amazing. If you've not tried, definitely try them. I bought two of these. They are a shine hair treatment, expertly blended for smooth, glossy hair with coconut oil. I bought one for myself and one for my daughter, 60p. I also bought, I can't remember what range it is, but I've got a scalp scrub from online and I love it. I don't use it loads. So I'm just gonna sit down a little bit because my feet and my legs have gone to sleep. Yeah, I, I found this scalp scrub and I absolutely love it. And I thought I'd give this one a go. I found it in Primark with caffeine and pro-vitamin B5, three pounds for this little pot. I don't know if none of you have tried a scalp scrub. Honestly, try it, it just, it's lush to give your hair a proper good scrub. Um, it just feels really, really, really nice. So I thought it'd be worth giving this a go for three pounds. Hopefully it's, it's decent. God, this box is actually really dusty. I found this perfume. It's 20 ml Uber Rose. I'm not sure if that's how you say it, petals, two pounds and it says a fruity floral fragrance with fruity top notes of mandarin and crisp apple heart of damask rose and sweet vanilla base i do like a sweetie perfume so i thought it'd be quite nice to keep in my bag for two pounds and then i got some brightening and depuffing eye patches i love eye patches i mean i'm not 100 percent sure if they actually do anything but they feel so cool and just lush on your on your face these are for dull and tired eyes yep dull and tired <laughs> um they were vitamin c peptides and licorice mm. they were one pound fifty and i thought it was just a set of two but you actually get 15 treatments which that's pretty good i think so i'm definitely trying those tonight 
I think that's all the beauty sort of bits. I picked up this cardigan, which is kind of like a bit of a crochet vibe. And I think it's really, really cute. I just thought with a maxi dress in the summer, I got this in a large and that was 13 pounds. Yeah, I thought it was really nice. And it's got these really lovely buttons as well. Almost like a little bit tortoise shell. So yeah, I've got that. And then you'll probably see that I tried this dress on. Now, the dress I tried on was so tight on my boobs. Literally, my boobs had no space of breathing at all. So I asked the lady to get me another size. And then it fitted a lot better around the bust but it is a beautiful smock dress. Now, the only thing I am not 100% keen on is the volume of the sleeves. I'm, I mean, you've seen the footage. Tell me what you think. I'm, I'm not 100% convinced on the huge puffiness, but my mother-in-law is amazing at... Um, making dresses, she she made my bridesmaids dresses. So I was thinking I could get her to alter these somehow so it's not so voluminous. But tell me what you think. You might think that in the try-on in the store it looked beautiful on, but I'm just not sure about the puffy sleeves. But it is, I think it feels linen, you know. It's just cotton, but it, it's got a linen-y feel about it. Yeah, it just says, made using recycled cotton. This was 15 pounds by the way. And um, yeah, I really, really, really love it. It's so summery. And then I was walking past that sort of area afterwards and I found these shorts. Now, I couldn't be bothered going back to the changing room because I'd already tried on loads and loads of clothes and I was really, really hot. So I saw these and thankfully underneath this dress, I had some cycling shorts. So I tried these on and yeah, the, the fit seemed to be quite good. Obviously I'll try them on again at home, but they are basically the same print in the shorts. They've got this beautiful fluted part on the pockets and it's a flat waistband at the front and then it is elasticated at the back. Yeah, and I just thought they were really, obviously I love that print. So I just thought, get the shorts as well. In the bag. I did get quite a lot of PJs this time. Actually, hang on. I've got a few more clothing bits, so I'm gonna show you that first, and then I will show you the PJs. So I just got a basic slouchy t-shirt, which I thought could go really nicely, kind of half tucked into those shorts I've just bought. And that was two pound fifty. Well, actually, it says two euros fifty. Don't know why it says euros, but never mind. And then I also bought this soft fabric. I'm not too sure what it is actually, but yeah, it's um, like a white blouse. It's quite sort of oversized. And then it's got this detail at the back and the neckline, which is just stretchy, which I quite like. It just gives a little bit of detail. And that was seven pounds. So yeah, it's nice and floaty. And it's so soft as well. Right, PJs. I saw this and I was like, oh my God, I love this. And I could imagine like on my holiday this year, I'm gonna be wearing this because I don't know why whenever I go on holiday, I think that, you know, oranges look, well they do, don't they? They look stunning against a tan and whites. So I found this really long nighty, And it's got two splits up the sides. It's super soft. It's almost like um, that sun's creeping in again. It's like a silky material. 
and then the back is elasticated a bit. It also has adjustable ties because I'm quite short in the upper body so I normally need it quite short there. But yeah, it's beautiful. And this was £12. I got it in a large because I wanted it to be quite roomy. Don't like anything kind of tight of an evening. But yeah, so lush. Love it. More PJs. I got some shorts. These were £6. They are like a lemony sort of colour. Well, they say light yellow, actually. And they are super soft material. A little bit fluted on the edging and a lovely thick waistband. Yeah, I, I really like those. And I like the waistband because I find with these, they don't cut in some kind of like if you're a little bit larger around your middle part i find that if i wear a lot of things that are elasticated they kind of like really i don't know almost cut your body in half whereas these i kind of like that waistband i don't ever feel that they do that to your body so yeah got some shorts and another pair of shorts these they're a medium, which normally I'd get a large, but they are, I mean, I'm hoping they fit. They are really stretchy, but they are this kind of lilac gingham in, is it a seersucker? Is that, is that the, is that, or was that, am I just completely imagine it? I'm sure it's called that. But yeah, it's kind of like bumpy. It's got the ruffled edge at the bottom. It's got a fake tie at the front but it doesn't actually do anything so it's just for kind of like decorative purposes and yeah i really like those and those were three pounds so i thought that was a really good price i was looking they had some really nice kind of like brushed cotton like vest tops and they had one in lilac but not my size i was gutted because obviously it would have gone perfectly i did buy so this is the same range as I was talking about the lilac one, it's like a brush cotton, but this is, um, what thing? No, light yellow again, but this is actually darker than the shorts. This was four pounds. It's quite, it seems to be quite floaty. It's not like, I don't like anything really tight and it just feels really soft as well. So I got that which actually they look quite nice up against the lilac shorts as well. I can't remember if I showed these in a previous video or not, but I bought these and absolutely loved them. And the Primark in Bristol is the only place I've seen them. My local store doesn't have them at all. But last time I bought them in a large and they were just too tight. So I am really hoping that the extra large is actually going to fit because I think these are stunning and will be so comfortable. But they are basically these little uh, wireless kind of bralettes. There's no kind of underwiring. It's got a lovely elasticated back, so obviously um, no catches. And also the adjustable straps. And this is in Oyster. It's like a silky satin. It's just stunning. I just really, really hope that these fit this time. And then I got another one. This is in Mocha. Same price again. I can't remember if I said last time. Did I say how much it was? Five pounds. And yet, I just think they're stunning. Absolutely stunning. Can't wait to wear those. I just think, yeah, so soft. Three pairs of their flip flops because let's face it, you cannot go wrong. 90p. I got these, which are a lovely kind of like orangey corally colour which I thought was very kind of holiday-ish that sort of colour. I got this stunning green colour there we go 
also 90p and I love green really really love green and if I can remember rightly I've, I've done a little Shein order and I'm sure I'm sure there's a dress that I've ordered that these will go with so yeah but if not I'll definitely wear them and then I also got a plain white pair also 90p I mean you just can't go wrong can you and then lastly, I got my granddaughter something. Now, we are a little bit mad about rainbows. So anytime I see anything to do with rainbows, I have to get something. This is kind of like a light green, I think, background with loads and loads of rainbows on it. And it says, be kind to yourself. Now, I don't particularly like that. And I know my daughter won't, but it's worth it for £1.80 and it's got all the rainbows on it so I know that she will love that too. So I think that is it. Whew, that was a lot. I really hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, I do love a good shopping haul and I hopefully you've seen the video a few new bits in. Um, I went to the Bristol store that was only that was about a month ago now um, and I was quite shocked that it was so many new bits in especially in the home section and um, also in the clothing section. But yeah I think my favourites have got to be this beautiful picture, uh, my cushion and I love that blue dress and I also love this which I think I will definitely be wearing tonight. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, if you enjoy these kinds of videos then please hit the subscribe button. Uh, I'd love for you to join me. Lots more videos to come. So take care everybody and I will see you soon. Bye!